Hi, welcome to another episode of Mondays with Marlos. I'm Gerard. This week, we're going to talk about what do cigars taste like. But before I get going, I need you to click on the subscribe button, click on the bell to be notified every single week of new episodes on Mondays with Marlos. Here's a topic I've been given. What do cigars taste like? Well, obviously, they're going to taste like smoke. It is a smoking you know, uh, thing that you're gonna do. So basically, this is what it comes down to, you guys. It's very easy for me to use the concept of coffee, no matter um, how floral a coffee tastes like, no matter how chocolatey coffee is, no matter how much caramel it has, it doesn't matter if it's Christmas blend or uh, Red Riding Hood blend, it's always gonna have that base of coffee flavor. So if you do not like coffee, doesn't matter if I say it tastes like peaches and strawberries, it's gonna have that coffee taste. Same thing with wine. A lot of people say some wine is oaky, some wines is like citrusy. And when it comes to cigars, they're definitely gonna have that flavor of smoke. But just like whatever I described, cigars can tend to have a lot of hints and flavors that are very, very um, appealing to us cigar smokers. Hints of chocolate, coffee, caramel. Um, you're gonna have definitely the white pepper and black pepper always as a base tone of the flavors when it comes to cigars. Now you have mild cigars, and then you have medium, and then you have full body. Body does not equate strength, right? You can have a cigar that is pretty diluted, low in body, meaning the flavors aren't really all there. It's just all puff of cloud of smoke. Doesn't have anything like, you know, cream or anything chocolate in there, but the nicotine content can be very high because it was totally under fermented and can really make you sick. When it comes to body, that means the content of smoke output, right? Does a cigar, you know, give you plenty mouthful of smoke that's going to take, give you the ability to categorize what kind of body it falls into and then when it comes to flavor when you smoke the cigar is it very diluted does it not really leave a lot of flavor in your mouth that's going to be a very m m mild in flavor right so most cigar smokers always want full flavor it doesn't matter if it's low in nicotine it doesn't matter if it's a mild in strength Flavor is what we're always chasing. And then when it comes to the strength of the cigar, a lot of people like mild to medium strength. They don't want that nicotine buzz in a very full, full strength cigar. And the reason why cigars that are full strength is gonna have a lot of nicotine in it is because they're under fermented. Ammonia is a byproduct of the tobacco. So whenever we are fermenting the tobacco, we're trying to get rid of the ammonia. And as you get rid of that, you're also getting rid of the nicotine and the strength of the cigar. So what do they taste like? Definitely tastes like smoke. But like I said, there's a lot of hints and notes. So you can look at some publications out there like halfwheel.com, uh, Cigar Coop. Um, you can go also on Blind Man's Puff. They do a lot of cigar ratings and they also write down the notes. Also, one more thing before I get going, the way we judge cigars when it comes to flavors, within thirds, we go first, second, and last third of the cigar, see if there's any change within it. Let me know in the comments what you think your cigars taste like or however you want to chime in on this topic. But before I get going, remember to uh, follow us on Instagram, like us on Facebook, and tell your friends to subscribe to our YouTube channel. See ya.